Winter is coming, horse. Winter is coming. So I'm walking along the King's Road through the dark hedges to Castle Black, the home of the Night Watch. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's because you don't watch Game of Thrones. But if you do, then you'll be very jealous right now, because I'm at the Dark Hedges. Now, Northern Ireland is the home to many of the scenes and the plots of Game of Thrones. And you can come down here and see it for yourself, or you can see it another way. If you want to see the Game of Thrones, take in the chopper. I've come up to the Causeway Coast on the northern tip near the town of Bushmills, where Bushmills whiskey originated. The beautiful scenery and ancient ruins are why many of the scenes of Game of Thrones was filmed here, attracting many fans of the show and tourists alike. But this is not the only reason why this is Northern Ireland's most visited destination. For centuries, people have been drawn to the mysterious marvel that is the Giant's Causeway. So we're going to go take a look at Giant's Causeway right now, which is a world UNESCO heritage site and the most popular place to visit here in Northern Ireland, because it's got 44,000 perfectly hexagonal columns that come out the ground. Why it's there? Well, there's a lot of myths and legend about why it's there. So let's go take a look. It's a collection of 44,000 basalt columns and perfectly hexagonal shapes coming out of the ground. Geologists believe that 65 million years ago, a volcano exploded. The lava flew into a riverbed, and as it cooled slowly, these cracks broke down into hexagonal shapes. So the geologist theory is a little bit far-fetched for the locals here. They believe a slightly different story. They believe a giant called Finn McCall the Irish giant, built the causeway so he could build a bridge between here and Scotland where he was going to go and fight the Scottish giant. But when he got there, he realised the Scottish giant was massive. So he came back over the causeway and he said to his wife, my God, the Scottish giant's enormous. We've got to be, we've got to run. And she said, I have a plan. So she dressed him up as a baby. And as the Scottish giant came over, he saw the baby which was actually Finn McCall and said, my God, if that's Finn McCall's baby, how big is Finn McCall? So he went back over the causeway. Finn McCall picked up a bit of ground, threw it at him, hit him on the head and killed him. That bit of land, they say, was the Lock of Nye, which ironically is exactly the same size and shape as the Isle of Man. So they believe that that's the bit of ground. Now, believe what you want to, the geologist story or the local folk story. <laughs> 